The Standard Bank's Dr. Elnam Wilman for more information on what we can expect of our GDP numbers for the fourth quarter. Elna, thank you so much for joining us this morning. What is your expectation for the fourth quarter GDP? Good morning. So I expect only 0.6%. Now that is at least a little bit better than the contraction that we had in the preceding quarter and the third quarter, but it is of course still very, very um, low. And mm. what is also discomforting about this is it's likely only coming from the consumers and those two part retirement savings withdrawals. The rest of the economy was still generally speaking quite weak in the fourth mm. quarter. Uh, what what caused this weakness in the fourth quarter? We we didn't have load shedding. Yes, so that's the main reason why we think the fourth quarter would be a little bit better than what we had uh, earlier in the year. If you think about the beginning of last year, for example, um, but we have expected a slightly better growth recovery. Given, like you say, we didn't have load shedding. The the political environment has improved. Business confidence has improved. Consumer confidence has improved. Um, but still only half a percent growth. Mm -hmm. Now, perhaps it, we're just too impatient. Perhaps it is still coming. And, and that's why we, we could see something between one and a half and two percent for the coming year. In other words, businesses were still kind of responding last year to those improvements. And now we'll see the growth. But we should also take into account that the global environment has deteriorated. It's a lot more uncertain, etc. So that mm -hmm. is then another factor that probably weighed on growth, not not only towards the end of last year, but also then in the coming year. Mm. Now, what sectors do you think will be significant? I know you mentioned the consumer base earlier, but what other sectors could we look for, um, to for growth for this year? So this year we expect growth to be reasonably broad-based. 